good baby whatever uh, oh my goodness okay <laughs> hey what's up guys hey what's up guys and be very welcome back to my channel how are you doing today hope you're doing great hope 2020 has been good to you so far let's start with this video um so as you can already tell I've got my eye area here already done and that's because shit and that's because today we're going to be reviewing a foundation <laughs> yes and I'm really excited to show you guys how this foundation is because this is not really a review I already tested it once a couple months ago it was yeah it was like two months ago so I can't really remember I just used it once I used a lot of products and foundations after that so yeah um this is gonna be a review okay let's put it like that it's a review like a first time situation going on today i'm going to be reviewing the matte perfection foundation by sephora which is this little guy right here so this is supposed to be full coverage i'm going to read you guys everything that i found about it it is a fluid foundation for a perfectly unified matte and long-lasting complexion it is full coverage um, it has a matte finish um, it is a creamy foundation and well it says for every skin type sensitive normal dry combination and oily so anyone can wear this this is a silky easy to apply formula offers the perfect combination of a matte result complete coverage and a long-lasting comfort it unifies, smooths and masks imperfections all day long for a flawless result. The high pigment waterproof, it is waterproof, damn, okay, and smudge proof formula is oil free and doesn't have a greasy film. Okay, you guys, so this is amazing from where I read. I got this foundation in three shades right here and we're gonna check it on my face to see which one is my shade so I purchased the number 17 which is the warm natural this one I purchased the number 20 which is cream and the number 24 which is honey this one okay um I'm gonna prime my face real quick I already got it clean and all of that let's put the primer So you guys, from all that I tried here on my face, I think cream is the best option for me. So I'm just gonna put like little dots of it on my skin. I'm excited. I can't really remember how this foundation worked. I'm gonna do half of my face with a brush and the other half with a sponge so we can see the difference. So this side I'm gonna do with a sponge. What? What the hell? You guys, can you see this? What? No way. No way. No way. No freaking way. I'm shook. This is so full coverage. I'm not kidding. What in the world? Okay. Okay, let's try the other side with a beauty blender. This is like a very thick formula. You guys, look at that. What? This is like a very thick formula. I can already tell that with this bond. It is super thick. What? My freckles are out. So that means full coverage. Yes. Come 
concealer? Who? We don't need concealer with this. What? Okay, I didn't, I'm, I'm being honest with you guys, I didn't remember how goddamn full coverage this was, and it really is. Maybe I said this was my shade, but maybe it's a little light? Mm. I don't know! Shall we mix it with another color? Maybe? Let me see. Let's mix it and put like one more layer to see if this can be built with a warm natural number 17. I definitely got more coverage with the sponge side. So yeah, there's that for you guys to know. I told you guys on my last video that this was the most full coverage foundation ever. Was I wrong? I don't think so. Hmm. I think all of the shades that I purchased are all too <laughs> light for me. Okay, you guys, so this is what my face is looking like right now. I'm speechless. This is so full coverage and it, it feels very lightweight on the skin. It doesn't feel like I have foundation on at all. So yeah, I'm happy with it. It covered everything I needed, y'all. I, I feel like I don't even need concealer. I didn't even go like to in here and it looks good in my opinion. But yeah, we're gonna put now some concealer, finish the rest of my face. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm gonna be using the infallible more than the concealer. Concealer. I need it like right here. This is also very full coverage, this concealer. It's amazing. I'm not gonna do too much of it. Since this is like a full coverage foundation, I wasn't gonna need a very full coverage concealer, but I love this one. So, I, and I wanna try it with this foundation to see if it works. I'm gonna go with this Fleur Mar Invisible Loose Powder. I'm gonna set my eyes with it. Hate when that happens. So now I'm gonna bronze my face a little. Just trying to like make myself not look like a ghost, but the formula is just great, it's just amazing, I love it, it is so full coverage and if you're a full coverage girl, you need to go get this foundation. Um, I think it retails for I think 10 euros, but I got this on Black Friday for like 3 euros each, that's why I bought 3, I was like, <laughs> what? No time to check my shade, let's buy all 3, I don't care, so that's what I did. Now I'm gonna go with my NARS blush in the shade Madly, you guys know that I always smile when I do this. <laughs> And now for highlighting, I'm gonna go with this Wet n Wild highlighting powder in the shade Precious Petals. Looks like this. Yes, love it. Okay, yeah, runny nose all the time. Gonna mess up my foundation. Shit. Sorry, you guys. Just one second. Just one thing, you guys. If you have this question when you're like, when you have a runny nose or you're sick and your nose is just really bothering you and you have like your makeup on fleek, all you have to do this and stick it up your nose. For real, you just, you can't like blow your nose normally because you're gonna mess your makeup, so that's a tip. <laughs> oh, now I'm gonna finish the bottom of my lashes. Um, where is my brush? Here, okay. So now let's go for lips. I'm gonna line my lips real quick. 
Okay, now I'm gonna go with my NYX matte lipstick in the shade, what shade is this? Free Spirit, yeah. Looks like this, it has a heart, it's so cute, love it. Look at that color, I love it so much. So creamy, love creamy lipsticks. They just keep your lips so hydrated, it's amazing. Okay, it's creamy but it's matte, so yeah. Okay you guys, so yeah, what do I have to say about this foundation? Um, I think it sits perfectly on the skin. Uh, my skin right now, it looks flawless and it is very, very lightweight, you guys. It is matte, it is full coverage, but you don't feel like you have foundation. You, I don't feel like I have foundation at all. Looks great, feels great. What else do I have to say? And it is so cheap. I have no words, you guys. This guy right here is basically just one of the best foundations you could purchase if you like full coverage it is amazing love it love it <laughs> i'm gonna head out i have some stuff to do and then i'm gonna go to dinner um so what time is it now so right now is 6 30 p.m and yeah i will be back to tell you guys how my skin is looking uh right now it looks amazing nothing to point out and I'll be back in a couple hours I don't know I have no idea and I will be telling you guys how this looks um and yeah see you in a bit so hello again guys now it's almost midnight it's 11 30 so yeah it's been it's been four hours um well let's see how this is going okay so first thoughts Around my nose area, y'all can see it's all red and stuff, but it's because I've been blowing my nose. This area right here, it's normal to be a little red and the product not being there. But besides that, I don't have any breakouts whatsoever. My skin looks good. Um, the only thing is like on my T-zone right here, here and on my chin, I'm a little bit oily. It got oily so it is a little bit shiny and stuff it is um, a matte foundation and it's supposed to keep your skin matte throughout the day I can say that that's not true because my skin here it's all oily but other than that I mean it's normal even with other very high quality foundations you get that oily skin even if they're matte so and yeah lipstick came off obviously I went to dinner it's not looking bad at all looks great it is approved totally love the fact that this foundation keeps your skin beautiful not breaking out whatsoever of course oiliness but you can always take a tissue and just you know I like this foundation it's great you guys it lasts at least for four hours <laughs> and I'm sure it could last even longer it's a very thick consistency which means that it is going to last in my opinion that's it for me today guys i hope you enjoyed this video i think that if you are a full coverage girl and you like matte foundations this one is really good for you thank you so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video if you enjoyed it you can also click that little bell so you can be notified whenever i post a video and also don't forget to follow me on my social media i will link my instagram down below so you guys can go check it out if you want i do quite a lot of makeup tutorials on my igtv so you guys can go check them out if you want so thank you once again so much for watching and i guess i will see you guys on my next video <laughs> bye